heat is gonna climb up there and do something. Don't do that. Don't do that, what I just did. Like, come look at this drop. Take a look. I was like on that beam right there. I know the, the extent of my abilities, so I was pretty comfortable doing that. But yeah, I don't, don't do that if you don't think you can handle that like I did. Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to Unbound Vision. We're here in beautiful Toronto, Ontario. And today, I'm very excited to say that I'm gonna be buying a new camera. I've been rocking the Canon 5D Mark III for like eight years now, and I love it. Uh, I'm just looking for some upgrades personally for some creative freedoms that I don't really have before. Canon R6 is what I'm getting today. So, I don't know if you guys have seen a lot about the R6, but it's just like, it's kind of a beast of a camera. Uh, Jarris actually just got the same camera and he's been praising it. So, you know, I have the exact same phone as, as Jarris, so I was like, I need the same camera as Jarris too, because we need to match at all times. Because, uh, you know, I just want to be Jarris. But uh, we're heading over to Henry's right now and we're gonna be picking up the camera. So I'm, I'm just really excited. I'm kind of, kind of tweaking right now. Um, I'm here with Duncan too. What's up, Duncan? He's been trying my film camera today. Film camera is going great. Oh. What are you looking at? It's right there. Oh. 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 Crispy. Another reminder, even though he just said this, you don't need the upgrade. Save your money, get some lenses. However, he has the money for it, might as well. <laughs> Alright, let's go. What is this? What is this? No paparazzi. No paparazzi. Kind of expensive, dude. Um, yeah, it's like a day's pay for me. <laughs> Can I give you the name? It's my mom's phone number. And I'm terrible with numbers. Uh, we called in. Um, you gotta ask about the adapter too, because you have L series lenses and they don't fit on that. Maybe I'll buy a 50 mil. 50 mil. Bro, this this lens, the 7200, is literally pretty well the same price as the, the body. They really though. Well, where's your camera, dude? I think they might have. Uh, I guess they only have reserves for 24 hours, so I might not be getting it today. I'll ask them when we, when they get new shipments. So this video might be extended to a couple days. We'll see. downstairs. <laughs> You're my hero, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I made sure I was like, this is, this is not here. This is for sure not here. The one time. Wow, that's nice. <laughs> Pickups. Uh, yeah, everything's meant. Cool. Take a, take a browse. Like, we have all the... All the What's up? Beautiful Toronto, Ontario. That's so overexposed. Okay, it went down. We're good. <laughs> <laughs> so we just got back from our little adventure to go get my camera. We did a little shopping at the Eaton Center too. Uh, good times, right Duncan? Yeah. Look at this guy. A lot of good food. A lot of good food. 
Oh. And teriyaki. Honestly, I'm surprised there's not more teriyaki. In Toronto. But there is more teriyaki. In your bag, there's more teriyaki. It was. Uh, Welcome to the unboxing. Honestly, <laughs> it's like the one place from my childhood that's just like, it's just the best food. Kind of like Swiss LA or something like that. Like your grandparents would always take you there. That was me with this place, dude. Oh. I respect. The box it. looks disgusting. Those are napkins. You ready? Mm, good lord. Oh, 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 oh make me hungry. Not working. <laughs> Do the unboxing of my Canon R6 that we just uh, purchased from Henry's. Um, this is what I've been using for the past like eight years or so. This is a Canon 5D Mark III. And you know, I, I love this camera. It's so fun. I shot a film on this. I've taken it all the way to the Arctic uh, of Canada and it's always done me pretty well. Yeah, I'm, I'm very excited about this. This is been something a uh, new camera I've been talking about getting a camera for a long time don't care are you ever gonna use that <laughs> I feel like every unboxer right now here we have the Canon <laughs> R6 wow look at that the one thing about this new camera is that these are RF mounts, which is a whole new mounting system from Canon. Um, and my old lenses, for example, this 24 to 105, which I've used for pretty well everything I've done, I cannot fit this on this camera, unfortunately. So I need to get an adapter if I want to do that, which I don't have right now. So I decided to just go for it, and I bought a 50 mm just so I can use the camera. It's pretty well the, the RF Nifty 50 and everyone that does photography knows about the Nifty 50 and how great it is. Uh, I'm gonna unbox this now and uh, pop her on there and I think we're gonna take some photos either today or tomorrow. So uh, stay tuned for those when we go out. I don't know if that'll be part of this video. Is that part of this video? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's gonna be. It's part of this video. It's <laughs> gonna be part of this video for sure. Uh, So quick, it's so sharp. Like, let me let me give you an example. We got this lovely here. I'll, I'll make it nice and bright for you. Got this lovely mannequin right here, right? And you remember I was talking about how I have these back button focus options, right? So I have one that's set to eye tracking, which is this button right here, and I have another button set to the center of frame, which is the star button right here. So if I want to eye track, I can just press this button and it'll track the face of something, right? But let's say I want to focus on the background because if I keep pressing this, it's never going to focus on the background, right? It's always going to focus on the, the subject in front. But if I want to focus on the background, all I have to do is frame center, press the center frame button, and now I'm focused on the background. And then I can take my picture. It's a really neat way of doing focus. So if you haven't tried back button focus options yet, give it a try. It's just going to work a lot faster for you. So uh, yeah, look into it. It's worth it. If you guys decide you want to use the five or the, the six, R6, I don't even know my own camera. What did he buy? Come over here. Come over here. What is going to happen over here? We have Nick Roy, ultimate climber, ninja warrior over here. He's gonna climb up there and do something. He's gonna take a picture, maybe a video. You never know these days. They're kind of like the same thing. See, that guy's a video. This is what you do to get unique photos right here. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna move that way over this way because I think the CN Tower in the background of this would be dope. Nobody else is gonna have this photo. Just me. There's a reason no one has this photo. 
have some crusty yeah, hands. Do you have water? Can I have some? Yes. Don't do that. Don't do that, what I just did. Like, come look at this drop. Right, take a look. I was like on that beam right there, right? Look at the drop. It's a pretty far drop, right? So that's, I know oh, the, the extents of my abilities, so I was pretty comfortable doing that. Um, and I was very careful in every every motion I made. Um, but yeah, I don't don't do that if you don't think you can handle that like I did. All right. Well, that concludes our day with the Canon R6, my first outing with it. Like, I'm still learning how to use this thing. And for those of you that have picked up a new camera, whether it be the R6 or any other camera, there's always gonna be a learning curve. And you know, I implore you to do your own research, look up tutorials or tips and tricks videos on the internet, and, um, and just go out there and take photos. You'll learn more as you take photos. Thank you for joining um, on the craziness of me almost killing myself. Again, don't do that. Um, we'll see you in the next one. Peace. <laughs> My ensalada is coming.